are getting excited. We're gonna have a little get together at our house tonight. For me, like as I was thinking about it yesterday, it is closing out an amazing year, an incredible year, an incredible decade. I was thinking back to 10 years ago, Ryler was one. I was just barely into my journey as a mom. Oh, 10 years ago, 2009, that is insane. I cannot believe 10 years has passed. We've had so many great years being married and having a family. I think taking the leap of faith in 2018 is what set 2019 up to be so amazing. We made some really scary big decisions in 2018 that were like terrifying to make. Brandon quitting his job to be a YouTuber, quitting his job to work at home, to take on a new journey with me. He and I work together in our business. That was a big scary decision and I feel like that is what set 2019 up to be as incredible as it was. We will touch more on that later because I really want to talk to Brandon about that. That's been, it's just been so amazing to focus on that this year with our family. Anyways, starting off to be a fantastic day, I am wearing a sparkly silver shirt that I got on clearance this last week whenever we went shopping at Lululemon. Yep, just a simple shirt pairing it with my favorite, favorite shoes. Yeah, and Miss Hazel, <gasps> are you all ready for a New Year's Eve party? Yeah. She's got her cute shirt she's wearing and also and a cute little bow. The boys are, however, and... you can see Kirby back here. Boys are still in pajamas. They are gonna stay home and hang out for a little bit. Hazy and I are gonna run to the store, get a few last minute things and be all ready for today. We're gonna go pick up Maddie. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be epic. It's gonna be savage and rad. Probably none of those words will be used in 2020. The vlog is uploaded, people. We did it. 2020 is gonna be great. Guys, 2019, we went out with a bang. We got the vlog. We did it. How was it we the crushed last it. video of the year? Everything stood in our way, but we didn't let it stop us. That's how you approach 2019, people. No, oh my gosh. 2020. You are so intense. Without the blooper, 2020. But guys, no, I was thinking about it. Think of the things that have stood in our way to keep us from posting a vlog, and we have no. never let it get in the way. Never. I have edited a vlog with my eyes so shut. Yeah, that was this year. That was this year. We were on a cruise ship with internet, <laughs> the speed of dial up. Took sometimes 18 hours to upload. Still did not miss not only getting a vlog up, but getting up at noon as promised. Guys, yes. nothing gets in our way. Nothing stops us. I'm on an adrenaline right rush right now. I'm we did it last night. Of you. <laughs> we crushed it. We got it up. We don't miss. That's how we bang them. We do it for you. We love you guys. You're the greatest. <laughs> While riding that hype train, that 2019 into 2020 hype train, I gotta let you guys know we dropped the best of video a little early on you. We dropped it as the last video of 2019, which means it's uploaded and viewable and ready for your enjoyment right now. So if you haven't watched it, stop watching this vlog. Literally, hit stop. <laughs> Go over and watch the best of video. It is a recap of all of our epic adventures in 2019 made entirely possible by each and every one of you. We can't thank you guys enough for the greatest, most epic, most insane year of our lives. So we dropped that a little bit early. I kind of got the pulse, the vibe on social media that New Year's Eve, the 31st, was more of a reflective day looking back, whereas I believe that January 1st, 2020 will be a day to look forward. So we decided we'd drop it early. We'd make it our last upload of 2019 so that everyone could look back on the most amazing year of our lives. Really a year that the THWB family will remember forever. So comment below if you can your favorite memory of 2019. What you like most about that video, make sure you go over and watch it. Smash the like early. As soon as it starts playing, just hit that like button. Let them know you love it. You guys, we had a lot of fun living that year, sharing it with you, documenting it. And we can't wait to see what 2020 holds for this family and for all of us. Yeah. Okay, well here's what's funny. Nobody even really noticed that you were gone because we lost all the footage from the day you were gone. I heard so about that. Maddie never left! <laughs> Mom was coming in with party supplies. Let's go out and see what we've got, you guys. Well, I went to Target. New Year's Eve 2019 party on her way. No, it's Where not. Where's my silver shirt? Ooh, that's shiny. Look though. Okay, okay, the kids okay. that I tried to buy online couldn't what? find all the sizes. Make some noise! <laughs> I can see perfectly. This is gonna be a great year. 2020 vision. Yeah. Here they are. Some of the groceries coming in hot. And a little bit of the bubbly. You know you're breaking in the new year when you break out the bubbly. I know. We got and chips. We got salsa. Bag. One of the things that was deleted in yesterday's vlog footage is mom alluded to a tradition that we have every New Year's Eve. Wanted to see if you guys could remember what it was. So if you know right now what our New Year's Eve tradition is, I want you to hit the like button because you know what it is. Smash the, the like timer. right now. It means you've been around for a while, at least a year. Kind of goes under the radar a little bit. It's a strange tradition. We're about to take part in that here in a little bit as we party prep and get ready to ring in the new Please year. For the disco ball. 
these sisters are party prepping. Woo! We bought these fun little kits, necklaces, hats, all the things. What are these, Maddie? Those are headbands. Oh, headbands. Hazy, are you helping sis? Yeah. So oh, nice of you. Sis. Making a big old bucket so whenever all of our guests get here, they can choose one. I love helping Can we build these? Sis. I'm not sure yeah. I'm my apologies. Why are you listening to me? Because people walk in, they can grab something fun. I will tell you, we've never really decorated or done much for a New Year's Eve party, so I don't know why we're doing it this year. Maybe it's just fun, something to do. Maddie and I and Hazy the other night went and bought all these decorations. Rex was with us too. We got some fun stuff for the table. Got these really cute plates and little napkins. It has all the makings to be a super fun night. I'm just so, I don't know why I'm so excited. I just am. It's gonna be a fun night. We're gonna have friends over later. Just gonna eat a lot of food, watch some TV. We got a lot of new games. We got a couple new games for Christmas. I can't wait to play. My friend Stephanie, who's coming tonight, she gave me this game, Cover Your Assets, and she said it's really fun. Even little kids can play it. We bought this one off of Target. I actually bought it for a white elephant game and loved it so much I bought it for ourselves. This has like really funny phrases and it's one that I can totally relate to because I was born in the 80s. And then Carpool Karaoke is a fun one. We also got sent, I think it's called Say Anything. The kids love the Disney color game, so we're gonna have all the games out for all the kids. Just having a fun time. I kind of have to laugh because I went into my little bin right here, random just stuff that I have. It's clear up there. I was able to find all of this gold cutlery. How cute is that? And you guys, I have exactly the amount for people that are coming. Totally didn't buy this, just had this on hand. And then last minute, I also found just the exact number of these that I needed. So how perfect is that? They're little champagne flutes. This is what we'll use right at New Year's. Bought some Martinelli's. It's gonna be a fun night. Matching mom's shirt here. We've got a sparkly holiday recipe. I don't New know that Year's. it actually turned out, so. We don't know what it is. We're gonna find out tonight, guys. Stand it's by. Christmas crack. So much good stuff. The party prep looks like it's just about complete, sweetie. We're coming along, folks. I made both desserts and I was gonna put them on the blog, but I didn't take any pictures. Take pictures of it going into my mouth, because that's gonna be happening tonight, you guys. We've got this all set up. Maddie actually ran to go get some last minute chips and salsa. She took Hazy, the two of them went to go get some chips and salsa. They're almost back, and when they return, because we are set up, we're prepped, we're ready for family, friends to come over and hang. Oh, I'm running out of breath in 2019, people. We are going to partake in our New Year's Eve tradition going down right when Maddie gets back. We got Maddie. She's back with us, successfully returned with some yeah. chips and salsa, but that's for later tonight because right now, it's tradition time. New Year's Eve tradition time. Right, oh, guy yeah. reminded me of this one last night, Maddie. Just had a friend call asking if he'd hang out. He said, I can't because it's time for my family tradition of what, you guys? Shut up! Chinese food, you guys. We go to this random all state. No, we go to this random China Isle restaurant every New Year's Eve. So if you're looking for us on New Year's Eve, this is where we are. This and we came we early this time. We came at like four o'clock because we thought maybe we'd be a little bit of the rush. Maybe we'd get here before because it does get busy. It Apparently gets it's so a common busy. thing. Now watch, we'll walk up and find out they're closed. But we're going in right now. New Year's Eve tradition, Bingham family at China Isle Yay. with Maddie. You're gonna think we're kidding when we tell you how busy this place normally is. Coming at four was genius. Oh, it was way genius. And we didn't really have lunch, so it's gonna be a good idea to have a little And we have food. so much food for tonight with the snacks and things like that. Everyone that's coming is bringing a lot of food, so we're gonna have snacks for the whole evening. So we gotta eat now, build up an appetite for our second win dinner of snacks. <laughs> but guys, in a minute, this place will be packed. Every time we come, there's a line all the way out oh. the door to be seated. We usually have to wait a long time. Kids get restless. So we are stoked on this earlier dinner time. Worked out awesome. And sleep and sleep and uh, she just told me she's tired and she's not going to bed for like seven and a half hours. I don't want to go to bed when we're having the party. Maddie's single serving of ham fried rice. So this is for me. <laughs> the food is here, it has arrived. The tradition is underway. Let's feast. With the Chinese food, New Year's Eve tradition out of the way, it's time to party. All the food's here, most of the guests are here. Let's get eating. Oh wait, so glad, Sarah brought me vegetables. Wait, what? What is that doing here? 2020 New Year's resolution? You're welcome. At least I have one healthy friend, because it's certainly not Stephanie. Stephanie, what did you bring? Peanut butter, chocolate. Stephanie's contribution. <laughs>
So you know we just got back from our Chinese tradition. We had to eat early today so we could save up some room for some extra oh, snacks I've here. Oh, I've got room. We got a delicious little cheese dip here, chips and salsa, some wings, chips. This is the table that matters the most over here. We got pink Starburst, peanut butter bars, calling this New Year's Eve crack. It's actually pretty good. We thought mom maybe messed it up, but it's pretty good. It's not terrible. Scotch roos or something like that. Twix cookies. This is where you'll find me tonight until the ball drops. I can see clearly into 2020. 2020 vision. I've been making that joke all night. Whoa, look at that lens. That is amazing. Wow. No, you did Oh my gosh. Oh, it's on. Awesome. It's <laughs> the adults are enjoying some conversation back here with some full tummies. I think we can barely move. The kids are getting some wiggles out with some Just Dance 2020. First time breaking this out ever. We're gonna see if we can get the adults up here dancing in a minute. Hazy Girl, did you know that they have Into the Unknown from Frozen 2 on here? I think we gotta do that one next. This has been the absolute hit of the party. Just Dance 2020 on the Nintendo Switch. There are six different controllers, so like six people dancing that are holding it's a controller. Amazing. But there are many more, including Michelle, who are dancing without a controller. Just getting a workout, just shaking the group thing, having a blast, guys. This was a hit tonight. Mindy, there is one thing significant missing from this dance party, though. A disco ball. We've got to get a disco ball. Get ready to get this dance party up a notch. You guys keep shaking your group things. We're going to turn this into a real disco right now. Mom, do not fall off the stool. Do not fall off the stool. Oh, um, yes. Yeah. Oh guys, it's about to go. So we've got this on a setting where it bounces to the beat. So this is literally illuminating to the beat of the song while the kids dance. This is a disco party. Look at how involved all these little kids are. All the little ones, just the small children having the time of their life. Maddie, this song's about you. This is the greatest idea ever. <laughs> 10,000 points! Well, the kids are over there dancing the night away. We're gonna break out the 90s trivia game. You guys saw we picked that up for a white elephant gift. We liked it so much, we ordered one for ourselves. So we're gonna be playing some, what's it called? Hello 90s trivia or something like that? Oh, I'm not saying that word. So, <laughs> we're gonna break out the 90s trivia game. I have a feeling I could potentially dominate with my buddy here because we were both children of the 70s slash 80s, which means we know the 90s. I want it that way, like actually, Kids are continuing to dance the night away. We got about like 30, 45 minutes till the ball drops. I can't believe we've made it. The adults are having a blast playing board games over here. I will say another hit of the night was that 90s game. We had so much fun with that. We're breaking into a new one now called Say Anything. Never tried that. Just count on these last few minutes of 2019, you guys, before we bring in the new year. 2020 coming at you next. We are a few moments from midnight. I feel like we need to open the bubbly and be ready to pass around a little sparkling cider. <laughs> Parties get a little crazy. We don't crack open the bubbly too often, but when we do, we crack it all the way. Grab some noisemakers, some hats. 2020's coming in hot right now. Look at Maddie getting all dolled up. That's 2020. Can't believe this is going down. It's happening right now. 2019 is gone. The whole decade gone. Got some noisemakers. We got a little pop. We got streamers. We got hats. We got a lot of noise, a lot of chaos. This is our very first time staying up until the midnight actual ball drop, and it has been a riot. It's been a lot of fun, a lot of craziness. 
lots of laughs, loads of noise. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. I've been hanging out for the last like five hours, you guys, waiting for this ball to drop. Time is officially on us. We have five minutes to go, five minutes till the ball drops. <laughs> under a minute away guys, under a minute. The ball's starting to go down, we're counting it down into 2020 right now you guys. End of a decade. 16, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 2020 and we'll just raise them up like that. You guys ready? Happy New Year 2020! It is officially 2020 coming at you. Yawning first thing out of the gates you in the guys, new year. It is almost two in the morning. Yeah, we did it. We did it. I'm, I'm very impressed. Proud of us. Threw together a nice little party. Stayed up till midnight. You know what? Tonight was fantastic. Happy 2020. Welcome to the new year. We've got to get into bed. We will see you tomorrow for January 1st. If you haven't, go watch last year's recap oh video. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. We love you guys so much. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.